What's going on, everybody? You know me, I'm BC. Welcome back to the Beachbox server. Here, of course, Hello. with Kraken. Hello. What's up, buddy? And we are still here at the breeder. If you look... Oh, one of the... Oh, how did they get out? How did they get through? Hmm. <laughs> so, but we know for sure it's working now. Yeah. <laughs> That's I'm, I'm very confused, but that's cool. It's working. Good to go. But what we're going to do today is we're going to start building the face. Yeah. So we've laid out a color palette right here. Graffin, let's tell me about this. I can never get it right. Well, this is skin color. This is tan color. Also <laughs> skin is, color? Uh, yeah, yeah it's, it's more tan, you know, when, when you go to the beach. But you're wearing, like, I don't know, uh, he seems to be wearing uh, some sort of algus, something like that. I don't know. It looks weird. But, uh, yeah, <laughs> this is the main skin. Well, low tone skin color. This is, this is the higher tone skin color. Okay, okay. And this is nose and cheekbones. Ah. Uh -huh. here, here we've got the... Uh, the color of the the step that he's going to use, oh, and this is yeah. the color of the mouth, and also the eyebrows. Oh, for and this is the collar, collar. Yeah, I got you. I got you. The collar. So yeah, that that's the color we're going to use. Uh, for the eyes, I'm probably going to go get some uh, quartz, just to fill the white because it's way more Whiter. white than anything else. Yeah. It's it's the whitest one. <laughs> you're white no. yeah it's uh so yeah so as you can see like we just started a little bit here just to place a little bit of things around but uh i think bc is gonna work on the face and i'm gonna start working on the color going all around uh so yeah i think it's gonna be a good idea like that so yeah, i think it's gonna work pretty good at the same place at the same time but yeah it's it's pretty easy like uh since I'm able to have the picture next to me, it's not that hard. Yes, and my biggest problem is we actually started recording this already, but I had my screen shrunk, so it didn't work at all. <laughs> but I guess what I can do is I can go, yeah, not full screen. Don't you have, like, a tablet or something that you could put next to it? Oh, I probably could. That, that's actually a good idea if you don't have to screen. you want to sleep first? But I guess it <laughs> is getting late. Your... I know you're up there, but... <laughs> Okay, let's take a sleep. So I think the hardest thing that I'm going to have like a machine that's going to do... <laughs> well, there'll be villagers in it, so we could probably... Yeah, I think we could use them. Yeah, everything's getting a little weird for me. Yes. So let's, okay. let's get some work done. I'm going to cut right here and just fix my camera. I'll be right back. All right. So, Kraken, what do you think, buddy? Hey. <laughs> You're pretty close to falling. Very close. That's why I crouched. So look, look at what we got so far. Look at that smile. <laughs> That's pretty rough. Yeah, he's... Uh, well, it's actually not a smile, but... Uh, I know, that's his uh, collar. So it looks like a horribly... <laughs> yeah. Iron but, golem uh, yeah, or something, but... It's probably going to help if we finish the face, you know? Yeah. <laughs> so let's head over there. Yeah. So we just want to take a look to see how it looked. But how derpy it looks. <laughs> yep, very derpy. Yeah, pretty it's, good. It's right. But wait, wait, wait. T take a look. Take a look at me. Then take a look at him. Oh. Take a look at, oh. take a look at him. It's it's pretty close. It is. That like smile. To, yeah, he, 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 he's trying to copy me or something. He wants to be just like you. <laughs> Yeah, uh, B BC's working on the face, so I thought I'd start uh, working on like the the sides. I have no idea how I'm going to do that since I don't have any pictures of that. Uh, I'm just going to go... Uh, it's going to wing the... it. Yeah, I'm just going to wing it. No normally it seems to be working for me, so... <laughs> that's how I did the base, and that's how I'll do his face. Oh, and he can even rhyme. Look at this guy. Yeah, I know, I know, right? I'm a pro at this. Well, not really, but... <laughs> Pro-ish? Yeah, I'm pro-ish. Yeah, I think that that's the term. 
One, two. Oh, how you came up here is a little. Tricky. Are you sure you have the right color there? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah you do. Okay, do you, I, I'm do the the the, the signs here. Oh, the burns go. Okay. Oh. That way we'll uh, we'll maybe see his face a little bit better. Yeah, I think you. I think this this color is up too high according to this. I'm sure it's fine though. Let's get it all in, but. Yeah. Let's just see here. Well, it, it should be fine. Like, uh, well, in the picture, it seemed, seemed fine. Yeah, and just, <laughs> when I'm adding this down here, it seems like it's... So that's going to be a smile. Is that a little too close? Oh, yeah, I see what you mean. That's, like, uh, a little bit too low. Like, it should be six blocks lower. Yeah. Instead, if uh, it's... Uh... Yeah, you see that? It's a little, like, oh, wait a minute. He, JT's rocking it out too. Welcome to the party, buddy. You can't <laughs> so hear me. One, I'm just saying. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, so the noise, the nose is okay. So yeah, may, maybe I just. Uh, well, I, think... I had to because I'm I'm trying to do the 3D effect. So maybe it was that my thing is. Uh, Colors a little too. So one, two, three, four. Uh, I might. Uh, you know, later I might change a couple of blocks because the darker color is really dark. So I might uh, change it a little bit and mix more uh, of the beige in there. You know, the, the skin color a little yeah. bit more. Well, well, what if we, what if we invert those? Change the opposite colors? Yeah, How does because it look? if you look at it, like he looks like he uh, he's been burning in the sun for a long time. Yeah, the colors are not quite. Yeah, See that great. So wait, uh, I was thinking maybe a pink wool. No, it's way too pink. Uh, way too pink. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Because yeah, I the color. It's exactly what we're saying. Maybe we got. What is it, light gray stain clay? Can we just go with gray, st gray stain clay? Maybe that instead of the white? No, it's gonna be too brown. Mm. Too, too much. Uh, I'm thinking maybe just more of the, the white stain clay. Less like of the a gray. A lot more. A lot, lot more. And maybe just use the white stain clay. I don't know. Let's give it a try. I'll do the side here with we'll just wait. We'll see what it looks like. Yeah, is the, this is a little bit, uh, you know, he, he doesn't look human. No, yeah, that's why. I mean. Well, he's not human. He he's looks... a villager, but I hear you. Well, the villager is human. I don't know. Have you seen what their noses? <laughs> I don't know many <laughs> well, people who are. <laughs> he's probably from Canada, right? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, and you're making fun of us. Wait a minute. I don't like that. No, he's probably from the west of Canada or something like that. Oh, I see. Yeah, I see. <laughs> does that look a little better? Uh, it actually does look a little bit better. A lot better or just a little bit better? A little, a little bit lot better. Yes. <laughs> so, yeah. Like, even if there's not a lot of detail, I don't mind. Oh, yeah. I don't mind if there's not a lot of details. It does look much better. And maybe yeah, we can so turn the gray into the nose. Instead of using hardened clay, we'll just go over to, to stain clay. Uh, Let me just do this other side. It's hard to concentrate. Yeah. Yeah, I, I think I really think we should remove all the light gray and just use just the, the, the white clay. It doesn't look good with the the, the light. Well, maybe it's my texture pack because I do have a texture pack. But oh. Let's remove it and take a look. But I'm pretty sure it's not going to change the color because it's no. faithful. Yeah, it didn't change anything. It just changed the, the quality of everything else. So I'm going to put it back. There. I don't know. Oh, case. I guess we need a mouth. The mouth? One, two. Uh, yeah, pro probably. <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah, do that, do that. He has a grin face, like that. Oh, <laughs> uh, come take a look at this. 
<laughs> but uh, the only thing is you made oh. a mistake. Uh, the <laughs> eyebrows are not that color. They're the 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 color color. I thought that was the same color. They're the color color. Color color color? Color color. Color the color color? Color color color. Color. Yeah, they're that color. Col well, they're the color of that color. So not the brown. We need the <laughs> dark. Yeah. Uh, but it's it's kind of hard to do because uh, unless you have gray dye, I don't have any uh, ink sacs. So you probably. Well, I got have. twenty one still yet. Okay. So oh, they're in this chest for there, you. I've got some here, so I'll try to go change it. Uh, yeah, I'll continue. Okay. Trying to save this. Oh man. Oh, and break that grace right there too. The what? We got gray stained clay right there beside you. Uh, the one in the middle? Right here. This one? Yeah. Okay. Uh, I guess the gray stained clay will be my ability. Climbing blocks. <laughs> I do have enough. I only have 20. I think I'm... No, I don't have enough. Yep. I'm missing... Uh, five. What color? <laughs> the, the color color. What color is that? <laughs> it's a gray, uh, gray stain clay. I got one piece. <laughs> yeah. Uh, can you throw me some... Uh, I'll uh, put them all in that chest for you. With the... Oh, you, you did it in the chest. Okay. Oh, I should learn how to jump. Did you miss or did you get it? Yeah, I fell. I missed. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, if we do this, we're gonna get that. There. We'll, we'll make it look good for you guys. We will do our uh, best. Hey, can, can you move? Uh, no, stay, stay there. Stay there. I'll pearl to you. Go! <laughs> Almost. <laughs> That's close. There we go. Oops, I forgot that I had the wings. <laughs> this guy's probably got a lot of forehead, holy. Well, actually it looks a lot better. <laughs> but you see, now it's the, the cheek that don't work. Yeah, so maybe we can turn the cheeks into gray. I don't know, we'll see. Why don't we get a little bit more progress done, and we'll bring them back when we have something better to show them. I can't believe the mouth is crooked. Oh, man. Oh, it's perfect. <laughs> He's doing, like, a grin face. <laughs> All right, guys. So, well, we, we worked a little bit on it, and uh, we, we, we thought that uh, it was a little bit too plain with just... The white stained clay. Yeah. Oh, so, well. Also, uh, the the village was too high for his head, so he said, "Why not take a bad and do a good with it?" So now he has a big mohawk. <laughs> He's got a huge mohawk. <laughs> like it, it's it's not that big. It's just really, 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 really gigantic. <laughs> so yeah, he's pretty cool. Uh, when we're done with it, uh, it's probably going to be even more awesome. Uh, we're thinking about uh, moving the mountain and making his body with his hand come out and stuff like that. Uh, so it's probably going to look cool. Yes. Uh, yeah, that, that's going to be a huge work. But uh, yeah, we're, we're going to do that. But uh, l let's, let's show you the inside. Because we were a little worried. Yes. Nothing much in. Because <laughs> um, with the mechanics of the breeder, we need air blocks, right, for the villagers to have access to sunlight or skylight. Yeah. So we were hoping so, it would work, and we just checked here. And it works. And thankfully it's working. Yeah, you might not be able to see it, but uh, behind those doors over here... But there, there's a hole just enough so that... Oh, yeah. Uh, right there. Yeah, oh, you can see it. Just right there. 
So that allows the door to count as a village, and that makes this possible. We went with a couple of potatoes. Just, just a couple, just like two chests, double chests, and uh, we should have babies in there, but I don't know if I see any. Can oh, even sorry guys. I'm looking. I swear they're in there, but I don't see any. But we've seen hearts galore, so we know it's yeah, possible. Yeah, it's, it's been harding for for like five minutes. But uh, yeah, if I look at the entities, there's 17, 16, 14. There should be around 15 in there. So when we started, we had two. So it seems to be working. <laughs> so yeah, uh, I did a mistake when I placed the tr the, the the fence gate. Oh. And I placed them on the wrong side. So the babies just went in and like they decided to go at the end. Squirted uh, out every yes. time. It was crazy. Yeah. So we had to uh, to switch the sides. But yeah, so that's about what we did. As you can see, the Moloch is uh, pretty gigantic. There's like a huge space up top. But uh, it works. Oh, as you can see, more hearts. So that means it's working. Yeah, they're making yeah, babies. They're... There's none exist. squirting out. I would say maybe 30, 30, 40 in there. What'd you think? Oh, um, you want 30 or 40 in there before we open it? Or that's how many's in there yeah. right now? No, I would say 30 or 40 in there before we open it. Yeah, I think that would be a good number. Because we don't want a million villages popping every second of the day, but we definitely <laughs> want a good start. Yeah, at some point we're probably even going to stop this when we're done having all the villagers and things. Oh yeah, once we get a good group. Get our one villager we need and then fill up the rest of this room with other villagers. Yeah, pretty much. Because it's we could actually just do one stand here with one enchant. Yeah. That's all we want. That's all that's all needed. Oh. <laughs> but yeah. So uh we're gonna work with things outside, trying to do the mountain and the harms. And uh, probably do something in the front so we can have the portal and everything coming in. Uh, and I guess we'll be right back after that. Yeah, let's get her done, buddy. Yeah. Uh, this looks good. Okay, I'll take yes. Uh, <laughs> welcome, guys. Welcome back, guys. Um, so as you can see, it's been a little while that the little babies up there have been growing up. We have 25 in the main spot. And the problem is, uh, I kind of forgot that I was here, and now we have around 40 waiting to get into cells. So we started working on that. And uh, the Quickly. idea we have is a water stream on top of the fence gate. Uh, so that way it's all gonna go around. And we can fit 18 villagers per level. We're just gonna use that side. Just right and there. We're yeah. gonna do a couple of layers at the bottom. Uh, we're not going to go higher because there's going to be a mechanism at the top for taking them out and, you know, separating them and stuff like that. Mm. So, yeah, probably what we're going to do. Uh, also, we can show you the little uh, contraption if you guys want in the back. It's pretty easy to do. Uh, if you want to close this when there's a when there's a minecart right there, so you put your minecart. Oh, I don't know if I got one on me. I have one. Okay. So, as you can see, it doesn't send the signal to this one, but it sends the signal to the one under it. Should. <laughs> this or time it's not working. Here. Oh, I, oh, I know why actually it's not working. Yeah. The the rail the rail is facing the wrong side. It's, it's stupid like that. I didn't know that worked. I didn't think that was a problem, but. Yep, it turned it off. Uh, Oh, you don't no, have a. I didn't. You don't have a card on it right. anymore. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So we put the the card. So now this one turns off. This one turns on. And at the top, you just need to interchange between redstone. So you see. Oh wait. <laughs> oh no. So you can't interchange. I, I was sure that you oh. could, but you can't. So, repeater goes here. So all of them will take a repeater. So it's going to turn it off when there's a, red, when there's a minecart. So no minecart, it's on. With minecart, I could have some space in my inventory. With minecart, 
it's off. So yeah, that's, that's pretty much how it's gonna be. Uh, the only problem with that is every time we put uh, we we put a rail, like we pretty much need. Uh, do you have some normal rails? I just put them in the chest here. I'll grab them. Okay. So the the only thing is uh, since we're facing a, uh, well, I'll need those. I'll need this. I'll just throw this away. <laughs> I'll take all the rail. Double chest. So as you can see, like you, you need to do something like this. Just to make sure that uh, your uh, that, that your rails connect the right way, uh, that way, or if you don't do that, what's gonna happen is this. Give me a second. <laughs> if it's just C5 pick. Mm, yeah, we just set up our beacon. They're gonna go on the other side, and then they could bump each other and could cause a whole bunch of trouble. Yeah, and the problem is gonna be. You're not getting any redstone from it, I think. But to, just to prove me wrong, it's gonna work. Yeah, it's working this time. <laughs> you know what? Yeah, that's even better than maybe we can just drop them all into one hole and just flush them all this way. Uh, okay, it's turning it off. I don't know why it wasn't turning it off earlier. I think it was. We were just crazy, probably. I would actually prefer if the if they were facing forward, just in case something goes wrong. Oh yeah. Yeah, something goes wrong. Like the middle you, one you dies. The right place. Like you, you want it at the right place, you don't want it uh, facing the wrong way. But uh, yeah, that's the little mechanism we're going to use and we're going to do that. Uh, we can, you know, align it all the way around. And I think it's going to be good. And it's a small thing. And uh, we decided to actually start doing it here. Uh, because it's better, we can hide the red zone under and it's not visible from the outside. And uh, yeah, that's about it. So we're, we're going to do a little... Uh, little floor and after that another floor probably bc yeah probably we'll see how much we get done here check how long yeah. our episode is too but i think i mean we're definitely going to keep rocking this out hopefully get this floor yeah. done for sure show you guys how it's going and show yeah. you what our plan is for round two the second floor yeah all right guys so see you in a bit Where so that was a quick five minutes wasn't it yeah so as you can see guys uh, we're done uh, we decided to go with uh, diorite, uh, this block that I don't want to name, and stone. It's pretty cool. I think it's a great uh, look. Can... Yeah. No, no we're, we're kidding. It's actually <laughs> this side. Yeah. Uh, we had a lot of problems doing this. <laughs> yes. As you can see, there's some parts uh, missing, but uh, we're going to do that. Um, there was a lot of things that wasn't working, especially because uh, they changed the way that minecart work. Now they're one block by one block, even if their actual skin isn't one block by one block. Um, so that makes it that you can't put a sign to make them go through water. So every eight blocks we had to lower the system. So that's what we did. It, it looks good. I th so yeah, I really like how it looks. It's cool change you know it's not the same as every other one yeah as you can and see one one farmer got out so we're just kind of leaving them we'll catch them later if we feel like it <laughs> yeah oh yeah uh in the middle is the is the the death sentence penalty i suppose yeah. <laughs> call it a death hole it's a death hole <laughs> yeah and they drop pretty much far down not, not too much just enough uh, probably here is going to be chests, just yeah. to uh, just to have storage to trade with them. Uh, I think it's going to be a good idea. Uh, but to, I think the the magic part is probably at the top. Uh, it was complicated. <laughs> <laughs> Took a while. He, he's this is this is honestly like the next day, or a couple days later. We've been trying to. Couple days later, yeah. We've been working on this forever, trying to get it to work. And Kraken came up yeah. with the idea last night. And I was able to put it together last night and this morning. Yeah, it's... Uh, well, for, first of all, let's start by saying uh, villagers can now move in minecarts, so they decide where they want to go. So you can't have just a spot where you're going to put them. So you need to remove all the minecarts. So, yeah. So that's not so, so much second, fun. second idea was, oh, let's use water. But how do you separate them in water? That didn't work. Then my third idea was, oh, let's put a minecart, then block them, then send them after. 
but that doesn't work because you can't block them and have a rail on top of the block that you move. Mm -hmm. so that doesn't work. So my last idea was, well, if you put water and two pistons to direct where you want to send them and just remove the piston that you want the water to flow through, then that might work. And well, I came out with this little machine. At the top, there's a water flow that sends them going in a circle. We'll show them. We'll show you that after. Just yeah. At the top where we do everything, and one of them sometimes two fall down here, and if you click the button on the right, you can keep him. If you click the button on the left, you kill him. Uh, so, well, the thing that you want to do here is you want to see what trades he has, but the problem is we don't have paper anymore, so I can't trade with him. Uh, so he's gonna have to wait a little bit just to see. Uh, well, he has an infinity book. <laughs> That's this so, guy uh, yeah, he's basically infinity. worth keeping already. Yeah, but we already have an infinity at the bottom. So I would like to know what other trade he has as the finish. Yeah. Uh, but we need paper to do that. Uh, but yeah, the, the thing that happens is when you press the button, uh, there's one line that sends to the piston in the back that retracts. The slab he's standing on. If we can look that at the piston there. over here, you can see it in the corner. Uh, so it retracts, sending in the water, and then it activates, well, it butt powers the, the clock on the side that has 16 items in it, enough time to give him, uh, to give the water the time to send him in the hole to his death or to the water flow that sends him to the minecart station over there. So, yeah. So that's what happened. So let's let, let's do a demonstration. Uh, is there one at the bottom? Yeah, there was one open at the bottom. You bet. We're ready for this guy. So let, let's see. If we want to keep him. Let, let's just wait for this guy to pass, so we don't get two at the same time. Uh, so we want to keep him. So he goes down, goes in the water, and then he's gonna come here on the side. And while that's happening, this guy just dropped in. Clear it. Yeah. So he's a cleric now. So, as you can see here at the bottom, the, the villager just goes around. You can go all the way at the top and drop where we try to put a minecart under him. Sometimes it happens that the minecart doesn't work because of the new ways everything is working. And it's... I'll, I'll be honest with you guys. Yesterday, I was so frustrated that it didn't play my... You, you see? You see? Like, he's straight on top of it. Oh, and he but, didn't go in. Didn't go in. So now you need to punch him, and you get two minecarts. <laughs> so, yeah, that's the problem. Lamb, you can't have a freaking villager like going anywhere now. It's like always broken. Yeah, but this is the Oof. second half. Yeah. A water stream. A water stream on top of fence gates, and at the bottom we have levers, so we can we can uh, select where we want it to go. Uh, I'm hearing a zombie. Probably outside. Hopefully. Yeah, it's night, so he's outside. Yeah, we started uh, putting them here. So we're trying to separate them. The librarians are going to take, like, most most of the spots. Yeah, basically all the rest almost is going to be librarians. Yeah, those are the ones we yeah. actually want. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty much the only reason we're doing all this. Well, the other reason is sometimes you need villagers. Yeah. So what we did is at the bottom completely, oh, yeah. there's a spot where they drop in... And they can go here. And when you flick the lever, they're going to come out and go in the portal. Uh, we're probably going to get an activation rail or something like that. Over yeah, here. To, to kick so them out and throw them right through. through. Yeah, right through. On the other side, we'll have to work on uh, doing a system to get the villagers correctly on the other side. But yeah. if you go look, villagers about to go down. Uh, some yeah, here they go. Sometimes it doesn't work, but it should work. Yeah, usually it works sometimes, you know. <laughs> it it's villagers, works. so it's almost impossible to make exact. Yeah, especially with the new uh, the new snapshots and stuff. Yeah. It's uh, I'm telling you, there we go. Perfect. Fit. And as you heard, the trap, the the fence gate just closed because at the bottom there's uh, detector rails like that, and when they land on it, it closes the fence gate and nothing can go through. And then we can't because we put these here, but these don't do anything anymore. <clears throat> yeah, they don't do anything. So. Now we just need to, uh, well, if you want, we can close it like that. Yeah. But just to make sure. 
But yeah, that that's what happens here. And uh yeah. <laughs> and it's working, which is huge. Yeah. Definitely this be careful so with villagers. Holy yeah, 1.9 trading is going to break... Uh, 1.9 is probably going to break a lot of uh, villager farms that people have. Yeah. Because uh, a lot of it doesn't work. And then up here at the very top, this is what you guys saw before. This is the basic design, and then we've just upgraded it to fit what we needed. Yeah. But right here, this is where the villagers are, the breeding villagers. Hard to see. Yeah. Here we are. Yeah, press the uh, button. We're yeah, we're probably going to put a dispenser on top just to be able to dispense all the time food or something like that. I'm not sure yet. Yeah, something good. Yeah. And this is the water stream. Yeah, as long as they're one under, what happens is he's touching the trip wire, which lowers the piston here. And when the piston goes up, it blocks the water. So that means there's nothing in there. And one's going to fall in as soon as he falls in. Piston goes down, water continues to flow. Yeah. So, yeah, it's a little machine, but it works. Yeah. Working, and then I think in the next few days, we will have what we need in here. And Wait, we might open it up for sale villager. to get your own villagers kind of thing, right, buddy? Yeah, it's pretty much a, 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 a mending villager. That's what we need. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That, that's pretty much that's, all we're gonna it stop is. yeah once we hit a mending villager we're gonna take a break for sure <laughs> yeah that's for sure not until then though i i need a break <laughs> <laughs> so clear um, do you want to kill him do you want to watch him get one get killed uh don't, don't we want to keep one maybe like get spawn so we can grab like his trades yeah well we do have a have cleric below us already 37 8 so maybe we just want to send him to spawn you think this one already uh, yeah. There'll be a hundred more. We'll probably get another good 35 drop. Sure. Well, it's because the lowest one, I think, is 36. Oh, so yeah. This one has 37 and 8 as gold, so it's not bad. What do you think? Kill him or keep uh, him? Your call, buddy. Keep him. Keep him. Well, we'll send him at the bottom. So, as you can see, keep. One goes down. Water continues. Leather worker. Now we've got a leather worker. Okay, do you want, well, do you want to watch do him die? some villagers. Yeah. Well, uh, yeah. Do you want to click and uh, we'll, we'll, we'll see what happens? See if we can bottoms. get down there. Let's do it. Well, I, I can. <laughs> you can see he drops and falls in the hole. And he's gone. Oh, I almost made it. But yeah, pretty cool. <laughs> the, the, the only reason why there's a big hole like that is because they can't die 16 blocks close to you. Or else it's gonna it's gonna affect the, the, the farm at the top. It's gonna stop working for a couple of minutes. Uh, so the trick is to you drop them away. Yeah. Oh, we want this at spawn, right? Uh, yes. I think it's all open at the bottom, so... I think you can just let it go and it's just gonna reach the bottom part. Perfect. Make sure my levers yeah, are all reach. good. The, the only, the only downside is... Oh! <laughs> the villager at the top just decided to go, uh, to go for a swim. Oh, nice. <laughs> Yep. So, uh, yeah, the the only thing is, like, it's really slow to go down. It takes a very long time. Yeah. But it's okay. It's okay. It's, it, it works. Well, this guy is trying to mess uh, up these other villagers. Yeah. Uh, where? Where yet? Oh, the this one that's broken free down below? I'm sorry. Oh, he, he, he's pushing it. Yeah. <laughs> he's definitely trying to get into trouble. There we go. Yeah, he's freaking out because he hears the zombies and uh, yeah. he wants to go inside the village at the top over there. But we won't but let yeah. him do that. So, I think I think we can leave uh, uh, on the outside. Yeah. While looking at the village. Yeah, dude, let's end it right there. Because yeah. have you guys seen so, it yet? I think we've shown you, but if we haven't. Oh, a zombie almost made it into the building. <laughs> oh. right, I'm going to go in the waters just to show you guys. If you haven't seen the final product, which you might not have. Yeah. So, this is the villager farm, guys. <laughs> it's a little bit of inse inception. It's a villager in a villager. Yeah. In a villager, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
So I think I think that's gonna be it because uh, th this has been a tremendous amount of work. <laughs> yes, but it's done. I, I mean, a little bit more I, I prettying, think, but it's done. Functionally, yeah, I, it works. I, I think I need like two weeks vacation. Man. Yeah. <laughs> well, book them. See what happens. Good luck. <laughs> but thank you guys for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you next time. Bye.